Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Stellaris Grand Admiral No Scaling. I'm your host, Colors Fade, and it's episode two. This is our Empire. We now have a wormhole over our home world. I don't know how that happened actually. <laughs> I can, you can hear the nut job. What? What? Where? Yeah. Mm -hmm. She's a little crazy right now. She's going through the rips. She's got the rips here. She's a little psycho. So we're trying to do an episode with crazy cat in the house. Um, let's see. We've got some money now. Construction complete. We might want to create another. Oh yeah, we were going to create some more jobs here. Let's do a little bit of assembly plates. How soon? Are they going to have their next pop? Oh, pretty soon they're going to want them to work that. 100 days they'll be there. Okay. Construction. Uh, we have lots of influence, so what I've basically told these guys is come in here and build. We'll try to get that working. The big thing is going to be here. We're going to need to shuffle some people over from the home world to here. This is the planet that's going to have to make it happen. Bump things up a little bit here. We were at the fastest to start the game and now things are slowing down a little bit. Got two neighbors. They like us. That's what we need to survive the early parts of this game. So this looks like this is a dead end over here. They have all this blocked off. So our next expansion route is going to be over here. There are several planets over here. There's a nice Special one over project here. Complete. Tropical world. Cybrex debris. So we get another Cybrex thing, which is really cool. So we can tell this person, hey, come down here. And uh, what do they do? Survey speed. They're really fast with survey speed. I might send them over here to do this. Let's make them do that. We are a Skyon. We are our, uh, the Holy Guardians, are our protectorates. They're our overlord. System survey complete. I'd like to run up here to core and get that as a choke point because later on we'll get a system survey migration complete. treaty with somebody. We should take a look at these guys. Jabba Ned. What kind of planet do they like? Silicon Farms. Let's see. What do we know about them? Anything? Continental habitability and tropical is what they like. Oh. That's too bad. What about these guys? Alpine and Arctic. Oh, but nobody nobody yet that can be desert. Darn. Okay. So so no desert peoples yet. Construction complete. No desert peoples. That's too bad. And there's what a desert oh it's an arid world over here, yeah, basically. So Science Ship, what are you doing? Okay. Hmm. Let's get you working on like, I don't know, this maybe. It's a long way for you to go. Why don't you go to the home world, buddy? Buddy boy. And help with research there. Yep, this will be the thing to do is move some people over to Colador. And they have to have how many jobs they got right now? Yeah. An odd factor. Holden. The odd factor. So we can resell some people. Won't cost us any influence because we're a core V system. We can move them to Colador. So that's what I'd like to do. Move some of your clicks over there, please. Because they're going to get these industrial jobs. They're going to get bumped up and do those. In fact, I'm 
building two more, and build three, and then another city district. We're gonna get these folks up here. System survey complete. These guys need some happiness, don't they? Lots of archaeologist sites. These guys are working on it. He's our main archaeologist. It's level 3, plus 25 speed. Oh, and now we're taking some... Some money hits. We got this guy working on piracy here. Making sure, trying to keep this from happening. Minus 19. Things are expensive, and the more you build, the more it costs you. Nice planet down here, Tropical World. I'd like to get that. What's it? Size 14, and it's just kind of. Might want to use it as a generator district world. Construction complete. Leader level experience gain. Would be very nice. Let's grab that. Construction ship. Okay, buddy. Here's what we got. Grab the hat. I had him building all of these to grab the land, but not necessarily to grab the mining, which would sort of help pay for those. It's still not going to be great. Holden, here you are. Let's see what your features look like. Nothing that we can get rid of right now, which is kind of a shame, so. Construction complete. We're gonna be moving people. System survey complete. Off holding for a long time. There's not much that this planet's gonna be able to do. Except, you know, basically provide growth for everybody else. Construction ship, yes. Get back to work. I think it might be wise to go do this. As fast as you can there, Bucko, because they're coming, so we need to cut them off. Colador puts another person to work, bumps us to minus one. That's nice. New contact, the Glur Covenant. They are spiritualist, pacifist, xenophile. The Glur Covenant. Okay. They Handshake protocols activated. A little screeching sound from them. Okay, and they need an embassy. That's fine. <laughs> Oh, poor guys. Artificial morale codes, 10%. What about these other guys? Ruthless capitalists. What is this? So, immigration treaties we can't make with any of these people. I wonder if that's because we're a Skyon. Hmm. Curious about that. Alrighty then. Well, this one. Yep. Let's give you some home theaters, and you can upgrade your building. It's what? Oh, we're a little short. First contact made with someone. As we plug away. Mm. Broken cyber core forms. Yay, it's a special project. Situation log updated. Right there. Research that project then first, buddy. Great. Cybrax, that's nice. That's nice. Science ship. You are over there. Okay. 
they're about to cut us off so that's fine this will be a good choke point here let's bring you back and use you for something a little more exploratory bring you down here here we start working on some of this mm -hmm. So who are System these survey complete. New contact. Merchants. Okay. Bonded merchants. Handshake protocols activated. Leave them where they are for now. What what are they like? Continental. Okay. Is everybody continental <laughs> this time around? The Glur. Continental. Tropical. Yeah. <laughs> Nobody likes deserts. Oh my. Well, if everybody would like us, that would be fantastic. Robot debris. Right there. Special project complete. Archaeological site complete. Okay. Why don't you go research those anomalies? Get everybody to work here. Keep working. Keep working. Colador, still putting people to work here. This is the homeworld. Nine days away for these people to be a little happier. Yay. Okay. Let's pay to upgrade that. Holden, still a colony. It's got two slots. What if we wanted to? <laughs> and we're over on our Empire Scroll. So, Colodora is actually going to be a really good planet for doing this because when you have an industrial district here, you're going to want to fill two building slots with civilian industries and the alloy forge alloy foundries so that's two more building slots that you can't do something with and by the time you tack on things like uh, strongholds precinct houses when things get higher up what it basically means is that um, it's it's good for bureaucracy because you could just keep putting bureaucracy on here but I like to have as many on research planets, that's where I like to, to build up. It's just Mount Grey Situation Grey log updated. Track on map. Go to Mount research Grey complete. Expedition. Okay. So, robot modification points, robo modding, star hold, which would be nice. It's really expensive though. Mining station output would be good too. Uh, let's go engineering research. For now. Fleeing aggressors. Automated dreadnought. Look at the size of that thing. Oh no. Where's that at? Oh, it's over Science here. Ship taking damage. Oh, our scientists. Oh, our leader died. The automated dreadnought is there. An odd factor. It still suits our needs. So, a couple of nice worlds there. Zipped. <laughs> One of our folks, that's too bad. We can go into robots, create a template for them. And what I'd like to do is just, uh, not enough, that's the one I'd like to do. So, usually I go Research these bonuses, complete. foods, and minerals, but then you gotta micromanage them on all your planets and stuff like that. So, this time I'm just gonna go uh, easier. So, pop assembly speed. Uh, Robot upkeep or pop housing usage. Let's go with robot upkeep. 
create that template. But how long is it going to take to apply? Situation log updated. Months. All right, I'm going to do that so that that's what we build from now on. Interesting. Okay. All right, energy from technicians. That would be nice. Oh, wildlife. We need to get that off of there. Yes. Clear that. That would be great. An odd factor. Invest in securing this location. Another pop goes missing from Holden. That's not good. We need those pops. Construction complete. Stop it, odd factor. We'll be able to get these wildlife off of here. That would be nice. Okay, now we're back up in the pluses there. That's nice. Construction. All right, you got this. Build that. Then build this. Then build this and build this. Science ship down here. Okay, I want you to be the one to go over here. Survey the system. We're going to go in here and we're going to say don't go in there. Don't anybody go around to there. Snails, we recently discovered several surplus starships that we have no use of. We're about to chuck them into the nearest sun, but then we thought of you, our dear scions. These are old ships. Some are no doubt older than your entire civilizations, but you should find them quite potent. Please take them. A small fleet of Rufari starships joins us. Well, that's nice. You. Let you go here and do this. So, a small fleet of Rufari starships. Where are they? 14 or 20 there at our homeworld. Well, they look like battle cruisers. Oh, oh, look at that. Oh, he's got some large psionic shields. 5.5k. Okay. Very nice. That's very cool. Thank you. Your home base can be here, and you can go there. That is expensive. <laughs> it's a double-edged sword. It's like having to pay estate taxes, isn't it? Okay, these guys say... Oh, they don't... They had somebody, and then... They either moved or took a job somewhere else. Or did something. We had... Current unemployment zero. That's nice. So this planet... So far as this is the one I'd like to actually change to our research world. So let's put a lab on it. Colorado would be the one we will want to start construction complete. Other things on it. Well, bureaucracy, I mean. Alright, good job. You did all of those things. I'm not I'm not in a big hurry to get that. Or this. It's five energy credits. It's alright. I'm in a much bigger hurry to go down here and get this. Pay for the yeah. Move over here. Build the research there. Alright, so this is done. Sacred text. Forced mindfulness modifier added given the following monthly unity plus five percent. That's nice. Okay, so that frees up a science ship. It frees up this guy here, who's our lead archaeologist. And now we can tell him, well, fine, go do this next site. There might be something even snazzier there. Which would be good. Let's see. Ah, look at these guys. Federated. That's not happening. Governor Muckschleck for sale. Sonic Pursuit, Secular State, Empty Shells. Extra National Authority, extending our influence to dominate subject nations. Yeah, well, that's going to take a while to do. Situation log updated. Over the moon impact track, go to. I need a science ship there. That shouldn't be hard. Let me have tons of scientists. There we go. Everybody likes us. Special project complete. Completed the modifications to the robots. Mm. 
Scanuri. Researcher upkeep. We don't have a lot of researchers. That's not going to help a ton. Colodor. This is what we'd like to do. Oh, we look still a little short, aren't we? Yep. Minerals. This is the planet we're going to want to send everybody to. Work these food jobs, work these jobs. We've got to come up with energy credits on another planet, though. And since minerals are in short supply, this has to be our mineral world. Special project complete. Marvelous. You're there. Move to... Oh, why don't you go do this? Survey that system and then research that anomaly. <coughs> Grab all of this. It would be wonderful. Nice little cul-de-sac. It would be cool to choke it off somewhere meaningful up here, but it doesn't look like we're going to be able to do it. And this is who? This is our scion. So this is great. We could work our way all the way over there. Beacon in the depths. Oh, and we're way over our naval capacity, that's why. So. Forty-one months on the tile blockers. I'm gonna go for. I'm gonna switch to the naval capacity. Fifty-six months, so that we can stop taking this penalty. Because that's what's happening with that, and it's not nice. It's not nice. Me no like. Construction complete. Construction complete. Great. Okay. System survey complete. Yep. So now you can do. Come on now. Oh, because <laughs> we're out of. Don't have enough stuff. To buy some. Let's do that. Build. 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 You guys are building science ship. Okay, System survey complete. excellent. You're here. Tell me what you can do over there. You. Excellent. What about here? Research that anomaly. I'm going to be able to abandon some of these science ships soon. <laughs> Which will be nice. Species of robots. Construction complete. Excellent. Down here. There's a uh, Six minerals there, six minerals here, six energy here, six minerals here. It's still not one of the richer systems I've seen. This big old cluster over here, but it's not too bad. Faction founded, they say. Well, Colador is going to create some administrative offices. Let's have to create another one of those. Gotta keep this number here. Actually, hold on, Colador. I don't know what is this. Later on, when we get that tech and can raise it up, it'll be good. What are you doing? You gonna come jump in the window? The psycho is prowling. Oh, there she comes. Jump on the table. She's headed to her window. It's like, I have to watch the other animals outside. They're doing Research things. Complete. They're doing stuff. <laughs> Minerals for miners, please. Need them badly. T 
tech. Whoa, what happened here? 77 months. What the heck happened? Everything slowed down. Oh, it's the penalty from here. It's this. And now that this moves, at the end of this month, this will be cheaper. Construction complete. Your tech score gets adjusted when you're over and above. Now it's saying 73 months. Should have went in the other direction. That's interesting. Hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? You looking for the ball? You looking for this? Yeah, you are, aren't you? You think you can just stick your head right in there? She's got these little felt balls that she loves me to throw for her so she can fetch them. But I told her I'm going to shoot a video. So now she's coming up here to investigate. Diamond in the rough. After the study on Istrum, science officer Olcog Gunwale reports that they have found the planet to be unusually rich in minerals. This discovery was made possible in large part thanks to a certain member of the science crew. Okay. Offer this protege a science officer position. They do good work where they are. Oh, give them a science officer position. What do they have? Scientist has gained oh research speed in their genius. Well, in that case, I don't want to have half geniuses that work on things. I want to have full geniuses that work on things. You, this person. You. Let's see. Hold on. Let's look at this again. You're at twenty-eight percent, and you're at twenty-nine. Okay, because you're only level two. <coughs> And they're level four. Now this is going to be 69 months. How it went from 40 months to 69 months, I'm not sure. It's like we lost. Oh, we lost something because some researchers somewhere are working some jobs. Situation log updated. Oh, this number's bad. Polador. Construction this complete. This could fix it. could fix it. What about this? Okay. You. Oh, what happened? Oh, this guy died. Okay. Well, in that case, this person's age 71 has void craft. And it's a level 5 of 8. So we're going to do that. And that changes things down here. You have no orders. You can now research that. He's missing someone. This person can come up here and research that. And we lose this science ship. But I think we have a free scientist. So they can resume their orders. Survey that. Okay. This is a bad number, though. This is what we're waiting for up here. Civilian Industries, 95 days. Hmm. Make it happen. System survey complete. Because this should be responsible for about 12 of these. It should put us in a surplus of like plus six, if my math is not off. Although my math is often off. End of the month, we'll be able to tell because it'll flow over. This says it produces 12. It's 2930. Rolled over to a new month and we're still in the hole. That's because we don't have enough people to work the jobs. Research complete. Special project complete. Now we will. Get all these people working these jobs. End of the month. Complete. This number should roll over. It should be bigger. Blue lasers. There it is. It's a plus one, though. Feels 
like it should be more than that. Science ship. Holden. Still don't really have a plan for you, do we? Scientists need to trade. You're not a colony anymore, are you? Let's take you as a tech world, then. You're gonna need some people. Can't do research labs until you get upgraded. So you're gonna have an unemployed pop over here. Safety check, alien factory. <laughs> Expiring in 1986. Okay, tech. 53 months remaining. What do we have for edicts? Land of Opportunity. Information Quarantine. Map the stars. Fortify the border. Education campaign. Recycling campaign. Yeah, we could turn that on. That might save us some money over the long haul. Immigration poll. Pop growth from immigration. Stability plus five and governing ethics attractions plus five. I'm going to go with that. Nanite System survey analysis. complete. Okay. Grab this. There's lots of stuff. Construction there. complete. Research agreement between those two people. Yeah, you went up there and grabbed all that, which is really good. Good job. Um, come down here and work with this guy. Okay, so very, very rarely. Only the very last part was successfully translated. Time to die. Fascinating. A little worthwhile modifier added given the following effects. Plus five happiness. Okay. So, next one. Go right here and excavate that site. Oh, I know what I want you to do. Come over here and get this. They might try to leapfrog us for that at some point in time. That would be bad. You, science man, you're down here. And there's just not a lot left, is there? Why don't you go over here? We'll go figure out the rest of the neighborhood. Go be Applebee's and tell me about the... Tell me how the rest of the neighborhood is there. Eating good in the neighborhood. I'll tell you what, if I'm eating good in the neighborhood, I'm probably not eating good. I'm probably not eating in Applebee's. Uh, and I say that as a person whose wife has owned a restaurant for 15 years. I believe this long before I met my wife. If I if I'm gonna sit down in a restaurant, I'm gonna find a local place that's not a chain. The chains don't need my money, but the local places do. So I'm going to find some place local, owned by, you know, local people, a mom and a pop, a husband and a wife, somebody like that, single mothers, single fathers, somebody that's got a business that, you know, that's their life. They're trying to make a go of it. And, and I can tell you, they, they are the people who need my money and I'm happy to give it to them. I know complete. they're going to make their food with care and love. It's not mass produced. <clears throat> That's just how I feel. I mean, I, I anybody who follows me on Twitter and has who found like my real account, you know, not my colors fade accounts. I have two Twitter accounts. And that's because I like, to, I like to keep the gaming stuff separate from everything else that's going on in my life. Um, but anybody who knows me knows that, knows how I feel about this stuff. Research complete. <clears throat> and when I see people on Twitter getting into these fat, it, for some reason, fast food burger chains is a big war on Twitter. Like, oh, in and out is the best. No, it's not. It's, it's what a burger or whatever. And I'm like, you know what? There are a thousand places in America I would rather go have a hamburger than any national chain. 
because I know what these people do. I even have one in a couple of the college. I, had, I live near two college towns. And there are a couple places in there, little, little mom and pop bars, man, that make some great, fantastic hamburgers. And I don't know why you would ever want to go eat anywhere else when you could sit down in one of those places and give your money locally to somebody who, who appreciates it, who's not a national chain, who's not just going to cut their CEO another billion dollar check. And the burger is a thousand times better anyways. You know, it's big, huge, thick. There's lots of stuff stuff that you can put on it and it's juicy and oh my god it's so good I, I laugh at these people posting these pictures of the burgers you know in and out is has a huge fandom but i'm laughing i'm looking at me like that that that's the same bun that's on every mass-produced fast food burger that isn't named wendy's you know wendy's has their own thing going on man i I appreciate them about as far as a fast food place goes. They, they're at least doing their own thing. But gosh, it's just, it's like, dang man, give your money to somebody close by and laud them. If you want, if you want to post picture of a food on the internet, and and bring attention to it, don't do it for a national chain. They have enough attention. They have advertising budgets, man. They got drive-throughs. They got all that crap. Go someplace locally that makes something awesome that you love. Take a picture of that and post that and tell that story. You know, become the humans of New York of local food. Like, I would love to have that job, actually. I would like to just travel around America, finding all these great places that are like my wife's restaurant or like some of these other restaurants that I live nearby. These small, locally owned, owned by families. You know, there's a Mexican restaurant in the town next to me in one of the college towns owned by this family. And the two sons basically run it now. And and I know them personally. They're great kids, man. And they care so much about their place. And whenever I'm thinking about going and getting Mexican food, I don't even give it a second thought, even though there are at least a half a dozen restaurants close by. It's like, no, I'm going over here. I mean, I'm going to see these guys and I'm going to go give them, I'm going to go give their family my money. Their dad makes the black bean dip. It's out of this world. And if he's not there to make it, you can't get it. <laughs> you know. So when we go there, they're like, do you want the black bean dip? I'm like, oh, dad's working. Yes, I want the black bean dip. It's amazing. You know, it's just. I guess as I've gotten older, I've really. I've really gotten turned off by fast food chains. I just kind of feel like, eh, big deal. Situation log updated. And I just don't understand getting into giant wars over those things. It's like, you know, they don't need your money and they don't need your adulation and they don't need you saying, this is the best burger on the planet, man. They don't need that. There's a whole bunch of people who do. <laughs> so let's let's signal boost the people. Let's let's signal boost the American dream. I mean, some at some point in time the American dream morphed into I want to have my own business here in this town, catering to people that I care about in a place System that I love to live. Complete. The American dream morphed from that into I want to be a CEO who makes fifty million dollars a year and I don't care how many people I hurt to get it. And I don't understand that. I don't get that. Like, the mom and pop was the dream, you know? And that's the, those are the people I want to support. System survey complete. You guys need to... This guy needs to get out of here. He needs to move back to here. All right. Complete. So if you see that the video kind of cutting in and out, it's because I'm using a hotkey with OBS to allow me to pause the recording of the video um, so I can do things like cough Special or, project complete. or take a drink or something. <laughs> wow, so Galactic Physodi Empire, we get Gun Whale now has the meticulous trait. Sensor malfunction. Plus two to that system, okay. Oh, and there's ten there, that's nice. So I'll have to go get that. All right, we're running into 
a situation where we don't have a lot of space left for our all of our researchers and all of our science vessels to do interesting things here. So, yeah, we're going to have to... Our money. We Construction were, we complete. We had a lot of money at one point in time. And, and what I could do here is go in and start selling some of this. And that would make up for it. The library. Yeah. So this ship's going to get that. System survey complete. Gonna come down here and get those 10. That'll be nice. What's our technology look like? We're 19 months away from upping the naval capacity, which will get us out of here, which will make us not take a penalty over there. That's so bad. That'll be good. Holden is saying, hey, I've got people. What do I do? Uh, you need to get to 10, I think, before we can... Planetary administration. You can't do planetary administration until the number pops is equal to 10. So we could take a couple of people and move them over to Holden. And that would Research allow us complete. to do this. Raise that up and put these people to work. Blue laser. Energy grid. Research energy grid is cheaper, so we'll do that. He's a level four, so that's the only reason I don't want to replace him with this other genius scientist that we got. This guy, he's busy commanding because he's only a level one right now. But we're going to shuffle him over soon. Construction complete. Excellent. Um, these guys are expanding the Skinnery bonded merchants, so I think the most important thing for us to do is cut on over there. Research complete. And have a choke point like right there. I'd like to get these systems, but that ain't gonna happen, so. They can talk and they want to talk to us. Commerce exchange. Hangar base and strike craft. Great. Crystal mines. I'd like to have that. I'll let, I'd also like to have the mining station up, but that'd be more important right now, actually. And with this guy, we can also run all the way up to here. And in fact, here, if we want to, because this effectively is a choke point. There's a giant ship up there that's going to eat anything, so. Colodor, let's unlock another slot here. So that we can put some more bureaucracy on it so we can get out of that. Spaceport under attack. The sailing seabird was unable to build a starbase in the Akamar. Resources have been refunded. The birth of space piracy. Akamar. Where's Akamar? Akronar. Where's that at? It was unable to build some there? Why? We'll figure that out in a little bit. I don't know what's going on there. Birth of Space Piracy, how big is this? 447, okay. Where's my really powerful fleet? Grab this guy. Go over here and eat this thing for lunch. We're gonna build on Colador here. We're gonna upgrade this in a second. Space Piracy, we got this guy chasing him and we got this shooting. Him. That. Take that fleet out. It costs you a lot of money to pay for it while they're up there running around. What are we looking at for technology? Six months for naval capacity. Okay. So he's there. I want him to move back to here. Go build that starbase over there. This science ship is in a position now it can excavate site. Okay, you guys did good. Go home. System survey complete. The library lurking in the shadows very loudly. <clears throat> Let's do this. Gonna need more of those. More of that. 
And you can also do, oh yeah, features. It's a lot of money right there. One month, woohoo. Research complete. Oh my gosh, there we go, finally. All right. Nail yeah, capacity. Go back to different, cl oh, gene clinics. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Do that. That's really important. I think I'd rather have you guys move to Colador. And take those jobs. Holden, all right, so Holden, what we're going to do with you is research a couple of them. The wormhole, an unexplored wormhole. It probably goes straight to our, our overlords, doesn't it? That would kind of make a lot of sense. complete pretty interesting start to this game investigating where's my good science ship that had there he is he's excavating situation log site. updated Which one? that one okay Last one. Unlocks a slot. I'm just gonna hang on to it. No need to use it yet. Rivalry. Not with us, and this is what I was hoping for. I wanna see this. I feel like if that's what the game's gonna look like for a while. System survey complete. We have a chance. We have a chance. So you're saying there's a chance. He's gonna only be able to do this system right here, so just build Starbase right there. They got the same idea. They're like, we're gonna come up here and grab all this. I really would have liked to have gone down here and got that planet. It's a Gaia world, profits retreat. I bet we could colonize it because it's the Rufari Guardians and we're their scion, but these guys won't be able Construction to. Construction complete. So these guys wrapped all the way around here. What I want to do is take a science ship here. Troubles in paradise. Do we, are, how are we doing on the Cybrex? Organic remains available. Right there. Oh, so you're investigating. You're at 51%. All right. You're doing it. You're just taking a long time. Construction complete. Okay, good job. So here's what you do. And you work your way back. And there's crystals there, which is nice. Colodor, agricultural district, nice. We need some more of this. You can move your people to Colodor. There will be jobs for them. <coughs> Should be very nice. Yep. Hold in. He's about to put two people to work. This research labs. System survey complete. It's gonna be like a habitat until we can start taking the research off of complete. It. Mining station output. I think I would like 
Star Hall's next. All right, so up here, Cybex Research Station. Yay. Situation log updated. The Galactic Community Cybex Research Station track on map go to. Who's there? You right there? You got no orders. Research that. Galactic Community, yes. He finished that, which is good. So we can tell him go down there and build that. And then grab this. <coughs> Very nice. And then what I wanted to do here. Yep, so right here in Colador. Grab two hangar bays. Oh, we don't have a deep space black site yet. Okay, we'll do a hydroponics bay. Deep space Research black complete. Sites in a bit. Chemical plants. Transit hub. Research. Two sides. Robot debris. Who died? Strategic resource discovered. Envoy died. Holden. You got one unemployed person. I'm not sure I want to build anything in this slot. They've got nine minutes. System survey so complete. Defensive pact invitation for those guys. Yeah. Probably could get away with some more research labs here. Let's do that. We need the research. That's the whole point, is we gotta get caught up. I mean you can go over here and you can Special look. project complete. Archaeological project completed. One subject's research thing found migration treaty proposed. So yeah, the Galactic Fizadai Empire. We're in last place. Our tech level is two thirty six. These guys is six forty one, four sixty one, eight twenty two. 919 so we're way behind and that's the thing we got to get caught up so that'll take a little bit migration treaty proposal <clears throat> i need somebody who likes desert planets but unfortunately we haven't found anybody like that yet so the sovereign julians like their alpine worlds the skinari like their continental worlds like us the Jabinids, like their continental worlds, like us. The Glur, like their tropicals, like us. The only ones who even would be worth it to have one uh, a trade with, an immigration treaty with, is these guys. Because they have an alpine world. So, the Julians. And do we have any alpines? we got desert. Arid, which is basically desert. Desert and desert. These are ocean worlds, so that's why they're where they're at. There's another, there's Tundra world. So that's, what is the Julians on Tundras? Their Tundra presence is 60. Another desert world. So yeah, it's, hmm. Doesn't do us a lot of good there. Oh god, it would have been great to be able to cut on over here and get all of this too, because there's another planet over here, Tropical World. Huh. Well, maybe System later on, survey complete. when we're super strong, we can just go take things that we want. <laughs> it take us a little bit to get there. Colador does that, and now we're out of Empire Sprawl Hell, which is awesome. We're making a little bit of money. Oops. Somebody died. A physics person died. Okay. That gives us a chance to put the genius who's busy commanding up there. Which means that his ship, right here, do we have somebody who's either a genius or is really good at... Nope. Okay, grab this guy then. Keep excavating that site. It's not a bad start. I mean, look, we got these guys right next to us. And these guys over here, but we managed to expand a little bit before we ran into either of them. Birth Research of the Galactic complete. Community. Gene clinics are ready. I think we want to get blockers cleared as fast as possible. Handshake protocols activated. Yeah, so. Special project complete. We're going to want to unlock these. Oh, Cybrex home system located. Yay. Science ship. You who are doing nothing, you now have something to go do. Excellent. Alright, hey, we can propose something. 
So let's propose it as soon as we can. The greater good. Charter of Workers' Rights. Yep. There we go. Handshake yeah, conservation. protocol activated. Support that one. All right, what do we have? Established embassy from a bunch of people. So let's see if any of these people like desert worlds. The Sindrin Index Rogue Servitors. Trapoxian Collective. Lots of people there. Civilization's end. The microorganism will make a fine weapon. Begins the remnant of a remnant event chain. Killer microorganism modifier to add. Given the following effects. Army collateral damage plus 100. Army damage plus 50%. Or quarantine the planet. Society research gained. And add that much research to that planet. Begins the remnant. Oh, no, no. I'm going to do this. Army collateral Situation damage. log updated. Okay, so... Drone study available. Remnant of remnant. Sanctuary. Track on map. Where is that at? Right there. Remnant of map. <coughs> hmm. Okay, where's my boy here? You. I had a job for you. Can you get over here? No worries, he says. I can't get over there. He says, you don't see a path forward. You can't go around this way. Can you go around this way? Go this way. We're going to try to find our way over there. New cast a spell. We can now use the Skyon cast a spell against the Guic Fruki activated. We can use the Skyon cast a spell against them? They're already at war with somebody. Wow. What are they like? Tundra preference. That's close. Uh, they, we have a tundra. We have one tundra world. Okay, let's take a look here at the end of this episode. The Zelven hegemony. Slaving. Oh, slavers. Arctic tundra. Okay. Alpine preference. A bunch of slavers in this one. Desert habitability. 80%. You guys... Okay. Improve. Relations. Um, I have to figure out one thing, which is why we can't appear to have any migration treaties with anybody. Oh, is it because I don't have a policy set up for it? Refugees welcome. Population control is prohibited. <clears throat> Slavery allowed. No, no, no. Yes. Purge prohibited. Yeah, we don't really. Refugees all welcome. Robotic workers allowed. Artificial intelligence servitude. We'll trade that later. Wealth creation. Initial border. First contact. Land appropriation. Resettlement allowed. Orbital bombardment. War philosophy. Um, <clears throat> and diplomatic stance. Refugees welcome. Hmm. And then what about our species? Fizadar. Set default rights. Living standards. Full citizenship. Military service. Colonization allowed. No population controls. No migration controls. So I gotta, I gotta do a little research there and figure that out. I want to know why I can't get a migration treaty with anybody right now. He's on his way over to do that. So I think this the best thing for you might be to go to Holden and assist with research because Holden is a research planet. Oops. Help if you could do this correctly there. Colors. There you go. Homeworld's got some research on it, but not a lot. There's another planet here. This is the one I'd like to put research on, too. But in order to do that, I'm going to have to swap this on another planet. So, I think the simplest thing to do is this. 
get a couple more cities here. All right, it's been a heck of an episode. It's been fun. I'm digging it. If you folks are digging it, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. And let me know what you think. Drop questions and comments down below. I'll see you next time. Grand Admiral. No scaling. Let's see if we can do it.